you're renting the Starlink system from us, when you've got the app installed, you can run the speed test by simply clicking on the app or of course using any of your other speed test options. You can see here importantly that we're getting more than 50 down. Typically this can get anywhere up to about 300 down in Australia, but the most important thing of installing the app is you will be able to use it to check for visibility to see if you can see the sky, but most importantly under settings, this button here, stow, is what you need to press to actually pack up your system because you can't force the satellite shut once you're powered down. So when you press stow, it will put the Starlink dish into the pack up position and then you can pack the unit away. As for your visibility, <coughs> you can click the visibility test here and with the sunlight today it probably won't look too great when we do this but just using the little camera in the cam phone here to collect all the dots in the sky now so we can view those results and then the app will show you if you've got good visibility of the sky from where you've chosen to set up your dish the lead is around about 15 meters long so you can put it in different locations we've currently got this running off the power on the Tesla with a little inverter and as you can see here the phone itself will tell us in a moment if we've got an optimal position currently and it's showing us there that it's not too bad there's no obstructions so it's probably as good as we're going to get for this particular setup and as we said before we are getting good speeds down on the Starlink before we did that test we used this computer to get 55 down on one test and the previous test 110 in the same location so there is a fair bit of variability but anything above 50 is good with the Starlink kits in Australia in September October 2022 it all packs up into this box which is how it will be shipped to you if you are renting one of these units from teslataxi.com.au or theabking.com.au